Look at those old cafes. It's yeah. so like cool, modern yeah. and stuff. You can see someone 30. making it like that now. I was 38. <laughs> it's beautiful. Holy so, Chicago. Uh, the Palmer Party, the Palmer House of Chicago. Yeah. He used to come in. He and his wife had uh, Packard Faith and oh, this was in the Hotel Pennsylvania. These are all top-notch musicians. We were there to uh, catch Jimmy Dorsey. Oh, cool. He worked with Buddy Morrow. He worked with uh, uh, Champagne Music. Mm. He did uh, freelance around all the uh, theaters in New York. These guys lived Works at the uh, Cabana, and this we lived at this this motel. We were right behind Lindy's, mm. just off Broadway at Fifty First Street. Sweetness, God, that's, and they that's... lived there too. Oh, here's but, another one with Duffy and Jane Russell. Yeah, from Hollywood. <laughs> and Rich Room. That's brilliant. I wonder if you could probably find some of those old episodes on YouTube or mm -hmm. someone on, on the net internet. If I wonder if any of them would be on the internet nowadays. Yeah. Some of the ones we've seen. Bloody the strand. Yeah. It's Amsterdam, Amsterdam, New York. Okay, that must be upstate somewhere. Yeah, that was in New York. Amsterdam, New York. He was killed in the war at Anzio in a band. Shrapnel hit him. Man. And this guy went with the, the very fine drummer, went with the, the army. Uh, Air Transport Command. All during the war. Did he make it out okay? Stationed in Miami. Yeah, he got out of it. They, you know, uh, transported material over to the front. And then they brought the wounded back and stuff like that. Yeah. They highly worked. <laughs> they worked their buns off. It's risky that. My brother did that too with American Airlines. Yeah. Flew up over through India, Merman, and back again. Over through the Europe, around uh, China and Burma, then back through uh, South America and back up home. Wow. Did he do that one time, or did he do it like all the time? He did all of all of the, through the war. Wow. And this is the Arcadia Ballroom? That's uh, about 50, uh, 52nd, 52nd at Broadway. Playing on Broadway, got a superstar in our midst. <laughs> yeah. Slick picture, you look quite young there. Yeah. But McGee Band. McQuaid? Is that how you say it? Mc yeah, McQuaid? McQuaid. We went to Puerto Rico. Yep. Sweet. Yeah. Hey, oh. McClay McCoy, I worked with him too. Yeah? McClay McCoy. His big demo was uh, Sugar Blues. Sugar Blues, how's that one go? Yeah, that was his big that one up. Sweet. 
Are you, is your name mentioned in here somewhere? I but you played with I, uh, I left the band after after Chicago, I think. They followed us to Las Vegas. And I joined the band and living was too damn expensive. Hotel and restaurants. Yeah. And I couldn't make any money. So is that when you moved to Detroit? Mm hmm. Is that when you came to uh, Detroit? Or yeah. did you? Oh, okay. No, this was out of Detroit. Oh, sweet. The, uh, You're getting into Detroit here. Mm -hmm. We were the Dupont band. The, uh, they sent for me from, from uh, Detroit to join the band, so I did. Yeah. You read the read the book on sight. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Scared the hell out of them. What What do you mean? Like they read the book on sight? Is in like you gave them your your price list and they said. Yeah, they They're expensive, uh, and you're like, hey, well, if you want me, you're gonna pay or something like that. No, yeah. They, uh, it's uh, sight reading a book, you know, like that, and playing it is difficult. Oh, you mean you looked at the music they gave you and then you just, you played read it, it and then you played it, it without looking again? Yeah. And they were like, wow. Well, no, no, I didn't memorize it, but I I was able to read it on sight. Sight reading. Like first time it seeing it, then yeah. put it straight away. It's I was really bad with that in band. Yeah. Man, I was there on the V, 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 V. V no V uh, Pearl Harbor Day. I was here. Me Frank Club in Lansing. Is Pearl yes. Harbor Day is in the day it happened or is in the holiday? No, or it was the day it happened. Oh. Cause we went from there back to New York. Must have been shocking that day. Yeah. It's like September the 11th for me. I'll always she, remember where I was. She sang with uh, uh, Betty Goodman. Wow. What was her name? Marie Marshall. I've got letters for her. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> That's one dress. Huh? That's one dress. It looks painful. They must have had the kind of things that makes, you know, the height. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't she, know. She's very beautiful, though. Happened with it. Dumb light maybe got into the camera or something. I don't know. Um, well, she looks very nice in that picture. Yeah, there she is. And they were going down. Uh, and they knew they were going down, but they still weren't listening to this idiot, you know? It was just a, That's fabulous. Was yeah, she had letters from... Uh, Oh, famous songwriters of the time, and uh, Lurella Parsons from the movies. Where is the Cascades Room? Is that in Michigan? That was in Ohio. Oh, okay. That's where the, I think Bob Chester Band came into town. And they had a, ra a radio sh Oh, that's a good shot. Sh shot. Yeah, that's... The Kriegsman Studio. Ready Masters Quintet. MCA Artists Limited. MCA, the biggest music corporation in the world. London, New York, Chicago, Beverly Hills, San Francisco, Cleveland, Dallas, Detroit, yeah, Boston, yeah. Minneapolis. Yeah, they finally gave up on bands and went to music stars, uh, movie stars. Hmm. Then they started buying studios and all that. And Kathy Ryan again. Did you play with them as well? Yeah, that's the same. Freddie Masters, mm -hmm. Kathy Ryan again, 
I love the mu mustaches and the outfits. Yeah. Everyone looks like they're just getting silly. Puerto Rico. Look at that dress. That's fabulous. Yeah. <laughs> it's a dancer. This is really more than Bring back a picture. Oh, she asked for some of those pictures. I'll have to take, get them out and copy them and send them to her. Mm. <laughs> Las Vegas. Las Vegas. Yeah. Is that like, is oh. that, like, that is, is that how real, it wasn't like that, was it? In 1957, yeah. Wow. It's, it's like the Old West or something. It is. It's the old frontier. Wow, it's so different now. Yeah, this is the old frontier. 1957. And it came the new frontier. Uh, they had casinos then? Yeah, there was really casinos. Uh, some girl singer owned this. Uh, famous girl singer. I can't remember her name. Is that Penny Masters? Hmm. We were at the Golden Nugget. 